Well, you feel the pain. <laughs> Look what we got going on today. Right. Episode three, SMK Podcast. Self-made kings, that's us right here. All of us right here. And one self-made queen. All right. All right. All right. Yeah. So guess what? We, our show is all about trying to inspire and motivate. So, uh, you know, as we go along, we want to try to just pull different people out of their comfort zone, whatever zone they're in, and just try to get them to another level. And if we can be that one that help to get you to that next level, then we want to be that. So as we go along, we want y'all to help us. We're going to help y'all. And that's what the whole podcast is going to be about. Y'all stay tuned. We got it going on. Starting off, we got J-Dub in the house. He's the new producer back here and recording artist and recording studio owner in the back of us going on back there in the house. J-Dub, y'all. All right. Yeah. And of course, we got my co host. Of course, we got my co host, Turkey Bad. All right. I know the stuff. Okay. Stuff. <laughs> okay. Stuff. But y'all yeah. don't know who we got for y'all tonight. Guess what? All along, man, we've been get, trying to work to this point. We started out with a couple rap shows, but we wanted to make it to the entrepreneurs because we knew that them is the ones that we really want to try to push out there because they're going to take us out there, you know? So, mm -hmm. guess what? We got somebody for y'all that's special in Lima right now. Lima's on Courtney J. Boy. Better say that because I was over there. I was over there. You better believe it. You better believe it. You better believe it. So, you know, it's just like we just trying to keep going. And we saw, we, it's just so many things about you, man. I don't, I don't know where to start at. And I, I looked at your bio and I looked at everything about you. And really, to tell the truth, from looking afar, I always have been a admirer. Right. So, because I, I watch so, you. And a lot of people yeah. don't know why I, I got a little history with you <laughs> right. and your mom. She got like the best mom. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> And I had my car wash. Well, yeah, well, man, well, I had my car wash going mm -hmm. on, and you was like this young mother that was coming along then. Mm -hmm. And I was just, you know, what I'm saying I'd be over there and I'd be working doing my car wash thing. But I see you, and you send your kids over, and they'll play basketball. I give them donuts. I had donuts coming from uh, the donut shop <laughs> early in the morning. They've been they got, they been they got a cold, but later and they ain't there. Right. You see them jokers when they walk through the door. Right. 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 They get the U-turn. Well, 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 but what I was going to say is that. I never got a chance to say that to you, man. And it was Thank like they're just watching this little single mother going over there bringing these kids, and they were just mm -hmm. like mountable. But but they had to be because right. your mom, she a mother. Right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 yeah. So I want you to know that, and I want mm -hmm. the people to know that. This is what we got going on yeah. in Lima. I mean, but but what I was trying to say is just so many different accolades that you've been achieving lately, Thank you. and it's lot is not being noticed. And I just hope that this show can bring all that out. I mean, you know, you got leadership awards and, oh, man, yeah. let me go on. But as the show go <laughs> on, right. we're okay. going to get to oh, that. Yeah. But, yeah. you know, just kind of just starting off, I want you to let kind of the people know who is Courtney and what and what is Courtney about, you know? Well, you know, Courtney J. Owens, that's that's my, my government name. Okay, government. Right now, I'm working on the works of Courtney J. Owens, which mm -hmm. is um, my life coaching practice. I started my whole life coaching practice. Okay. And I'm still doing my poetry, okay. my motivational yeah. speaking, yes. and, you know, basically public speaking. Right. And everything right. really started for me being in hip-hop. Uh -huh. Like, I released a, a hip hop tape like back in 2005. I remember. Like, That's crazy. You know, like, yeah. I have been doing this since yeah. I was like, Man, 100. 100. Yeah. Like, yeah. Inspiration right there. Up. Yeah. That's and inspiration. It, as I, you know, got older, my craft just kind of crossed over uh -huh. into spoken word. Yeah. And I found my niche. And right now, uh -huh. everything has come. Uh -huh. From my spoken word, and it's like wow. take off right wow. now. I put That's my crazy. foot on the gas and like, <laughs> I'm not say that. Up. I'm better, better set up. up. Right. Don't, Don't let up. up. Uh, so when you say when you say spoken words, what what is spoken words about? It's just you know everything I do is inspirational uh -huh. and, uh -huh. and motivational, uh -huh. and it might See. even be about social change and yeah. social injustice. Uh -huh. And I just write what I feel and right. write from the heart. Right. And right. Wow, and it, it just comes out. That's what it is. That's what it is. That's a gift of gab, right? Yeah, the gift of gab. Yeah, the gift of gab. It's grew just from rhyming. Right, 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 right cuz on. Yes, yeah. what's up? Just man, I seen, I seen it, man. I mean, the first time you ever came over to the shop, I mean, my sister, you know my right, sister Denise, yeah, you know sure what I'm saying? Do. 
and a beautiful spirit. Mm -hmm. And um, I mean, you came up in the shop, and I ain't even know you there. Right. You know, Denise this, you know, Denise always hype. She always up. You know, I when she come in the studio mm -hmm. back there. Yeah. Right. And she was like, well, Courtney, give me what you got. <laughs> man, you started spitting up in there. I was like, man, what are you doing from, man? I mean, right there on the, spot, on, the, on the diamond. I mean, you know what I'm saying? It's just like, it's a whole bunch uh -huh. to you, man, that... I, like I said, I can say over and over again, but I want to try to explore that today. Right. Yeah. Okay, so uh, your mom, your kids, oh, yeah, I mean, yeah. so you got two boys, yeah, right? two boys. They uh -huh. are 19 Tell us about and them. 16. About them? Uh -huh. My oldest boy, he um, finished up his year at Tiffin playing football. Okay, and yeah, yeah I know about him. He's a beast. Uh -huh. In January. Okay. Right. Mm -hmm. And my youngest boy, he's a, a temp grader over at Lima Senior playing okay. football, okay. playing varsity mm -hmm. football. Right. So they both, you know, just coming up and cro all right. All right. All right. All right. All right. That's the real. That's real. Young uh -huh. teenage to yeah. the young man yeah. stage. Yeah. And yeah. just yeah. trying to guide yeah. and navigate them through life. Right. Right. That's them, right. Like, if you yeah. make a mistake, just learn from yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. 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 Yeah.
everything seems so hard, but once you put yourself in the right place, yep. God got everything else. Yeah, everything yeah, else yeah. just start falling yeah. in line, start falling yeah, in line. It's, it's like, like you got to move out your yeah, own yeah, way. Yeah, but we got to go yeah, out there and get another You know, I like that. I like that. I'm loving that. I'm loving that. So, Liberia Congress. Oh, man. Accolades this week. You 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 get like voted like number one in the. It's a leadership program. Leader, I'm telling yeah, you, yeah. I, I yeah. just found out. Y'all been hearing about this so I'm like, wow, a lot of people going on. Yeah, yeah. Man. Yeah. You you in the leadership you program, but you on. win almost the best leader. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's and, like, and the crazy thing, I wasn't even supposed to be there. Wow. Like, mm. The lady that sponsored me, you know, she was the like only the leader store yeah. back in the day when my mom and was kids. They just okay. the leader, but for us, we would know it as Elder Beerman now. Okay. So she owned this, and she's 94. You know, years young. I won't even say years old. She's oh, right, 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 right. And she well, looked yeah. around and she seen the demographics of the program. Like, uh -huh. wait a minute, it ain't enough mixing up here. Okay, you know, black on. people. Uh -huh. yeah. all the there we go. You know, yeah, that's important, right? right. Yes. Yeah. So uh -huh. she said, look, I, I, I'm willing to sponsor somebody to go in and then I get in there and then I win her award. Right. And right. I met her and, you know, she was a little video lady. I'm taking right. pictures that's with her. Right. She's yeah. like, can you sit down? Because like, I'm so tall over her. Uh -huh. She's like, can you sit down and take the picture? And I sat down and she's still right here. Right. <laughs> right. You know, but yeah. it's just motivation. <laughs> But when you rub right. elbows with these type right. of people, yeah, yeah, I can yeah, sit in these yeah, rooms too. Yeah, like I can go yeah. to the hood and kick it, uh -huh. but I can also go in boardrooms and kick yeah, you it. Go. Uh -huh. So that's how that. you got to get the advantage yeah. and get yeah. the jump. So yeah. you'll yeah. be able to bring other people oh, up as you go real. up. And that's real. Like in my yeah. book, like wow. I always say, the only time you should look down is mm -hmm. if you, you know, got to tie your shoes and yeah. the money on, on the ground. Right, right. You looking down, you looking somebody up. Yeah, say that. Okay, then say that. Say that. Wow. Say that. But you know what? Then you listen to what you. You saying man it's like man if y'all y'all just tune in man listen to her but you know what you just said something too you said she was kind of she's small right right it's next to you uh -huh. but look at it but but in stature i mean in um yes. like um just the whole worth yeah you know what i'm saying it's so yeah. big right it's so big man, though that's how small, know, somebody that small <laughs> sitting next to you you'll think they ain't worth nothing man. and then but you know saying the heart and everything that they done done it just it don't it don't have to do with your size it don't have to do with the size and that's crazy. That's crazy, yeah. man. I'm I'm loving it, man. I'm loving it. And I just like I said, I just want people to know more about you, right? You, you know. Because I, I got a question for you. Go ahead, to, go ahead, Turkey. Who is, who is your biggest influence that do what you do? You know what I'm saying? Oh, Anything that you got yeah. going on in your life yes. right now? Like right present. now, you know, I would have to say my mom first and foremost. Ooh, well, she a beast, man. Watching her growing up and, and raising my brothers mm -hmm. and, and how she has overcome and overcame. Yes, well, honey, you know. And, right. and with my whole poetry, I would say, of course, the great Maya Angelou. Uh, you know, when I, when I, I, I listen to her voice. I listen to the way that she delivered uh, and just the impact. Uh, and, it. you know, she was a writer. Yeah. And then, you know, everything yeah. just transitioned yeah. over for her. And she just spit knowledge and, and uh, wisdom all the time. Like, even when you great. look at her now, right. like in her past, like, of yeah. course, she's going on to the essence now. But when you look at her and you hear her voice, mm -hmm. that's all you hear is wisdom and knowledge mm -hmm. and that legacy, the legacy yes. that she left behind. You yes. know, I want to uh -huh. walk in the shadows of that legacy. Oh, that and means you know, something. like leave my own that's legacy. Important. That means right. something. That's big. Yeah. That's big. Wow. Yeah. Sure. Hey, but yeah. check that out, man. It's just it's crazy because it's like we just had we just had somebody on the show, uh, Biggie. Right. And Biggie trying Biggie want to be in the light of the real Biggie. Right, no doubt. Man, yeah, I mean, yeah. just look, look how he trying to think. Uh -huh. Wow. And it's like, you have you on the show, and then look yeah. how you trying to think. Man, I mean, if you can rub, even if I can do anything that she done, right. you know what I'm saying? You you rubbing elbows with greatness. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Period. And wow, yeah. just to even think that you even think like that. That's, yeah, that's, a, that's, a, that's a whole other level. And you know what? Good state of mind. Right, yeah. I listen to like uh, Les Brown. He's like a great motivational yeah. mm -hmm. speaker. Yep, I know. And he always say, Find you a person that you really admire mm -hmm. and then yeah. dig into their then you like, career, yeah, yeah, yeah. dig into yeah. what they have done yeah. and yeah. study uh, them. You yeah. know, sometimes you don't yeah. have to reinvent the wheel, yeah. it's already there. Right. Yeah. You just have talk, to study talk, the study people. Yeah, right. You know, they came before you. Yeah. Yeah. That's the that's what better, what better, what better model? What better model? We gonna run off, you know? Say you run off over this way. I mean, some some of the paths already been laid. Yeah. All we gotta do is just follow. follow you know? yeah. We follow gonna be, suit. we be ourselves. Yeah. We're just doing it a different way, but still, it's the path is right there. Yeah. Yeah. That's crazy. But you know, we oh, okay, okay, man. <laughs> oh, but look here. Okay, all right. From there, uh -huh. you do every all of this. 
Yeah. How do poetry fit into all of this Man. that you do? <laughs> I know my Angelo was a big fan. Like, like, how do poetry and, and you know and rapping and all of that? How do that fit into everything that you do? It's yeah. like it captivates people. Uh huh. And like with poetry, mm -hmm. you can really feel like the soul of it all. When I'm yeah. writing my poetry, I'm really putting my heart and soul For sure. on the paper. Okay. So everything that I say, mm -hmm. you know, that is coming from the soul. Wow, you know, that's real yeah. heavy. I and believe that and the poetry is just like the icing on the cake. All oh, right. Like you can, I can, <laughs> yeah. you know, write poetry about the sun, the moon, and the stars. Uh, so right, when right, I'm going to make it, I'm going to flip it into a way that's going to uplift you. For yeah. sure. You got to think like, dang, even in darkness, right. there's yeah. the moon. Or yeah. even like, you know, the yeah. only way the stars is going to come out is when it's dark. Right, so, right. Know, it's come just on, like a lot of metaphors. Right, right, right. It'll make you sit back and think like, yeah, well, yeah. Right, yeah, right. It's, it's, you're a rapper. You're yeah, a rapper. Right. Yeah, then, so you know what I'm saying? So it's oh, yeah, oh, it's just, oh, oh my yeah, goodness. Right. It's just so, locked right in, you know? Yeah. And that's that's just, man, it's just so much to you, so much to you. So much, so much. Yeah. But we going to keep on going. What I got to do right now, y'all, I got to go pay a couple of bills. So guess what? We're going to take a small little break. And guess what? We'll be right back with you. Guess what? SMJ right. Podcast is in your baby. face. So, we'll get back. We out as I said before, SMK Podcast coming at you again, self-made kings. That means you can be anybody that you want to be. You, we try to inspire you to be that type of person to where we, we all come from kings. You know, we got a lady here that's a queen. And so as once we believe that, once you believe that what your calling is, you can step into that and you can be that true person. But it just has to be brought out. You have to know that. If you don't know that, then, you know, we lost on that. So as we go, we're going to try to let everybody know during the different segments that that's what it's all about. Self-made kings, that's about inspiring and motivating. And you come out your comfort zone and being the type of person that you can be and you can be better than leaving that person that you can be. Okay, but before we left on the show, we had something going on right here. J-Double over here, he feeling some type of way because a long time ago, he got smoked by Courtney oh, in a rap contest. <laughs> so he wanted to talk about it off camera so he could get it all straight to how they got how he got beat. But I wanted to tell really how it all happened because he got like he, you know, he really didn't get beat, but he got beat, but he got beat, but he didn't get beat. Huh? That's one of them little kids that you catch. Did you do that? No, I ain't do it, but I did it, but I didn't do it, but I, you. <laughs> okay, so, Courtney, tell us what happened with Jay Dell. Tell us what's going on with that. I mean, I accept defeat because a win is a win. How all that happened? How all that happened? If they, if, the, if they say it's a win, it's a win. So, but, you know, I respected it, but it was crazy to me because it was two women. You know what I mean? And they came up there together as a group and they did their thing. How all this happened? Now, tell, tell the story. Let me hear about it. How you got what? Man, uh. <laughs> <laughs> I want to know, oh, man. man. you make it sound so bad. Right? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I was young, though, man. I was probably like 13 or 14. I don't know. Yeah. I, I don't know. It was like in like 98 or something. Yeah, it, yeah. Okay. It was, okay. be about it was 98. like Duke's Platinum Records because I ain't remember that till you told yeah. me. But yeah, we had a little. Concert going on, you know what I'm saying? Okay, well, it was okay. a freestyle thing. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. We was up there, you know. I went up there, I did my thing as usual. You know, yeah, yeah, you know yeah. Jay Dell got it locked down. You know, it was over with. Later in the day, he they said it was to over with. Get people to come up yeah. there, you know, to yeah. try to uh, do what they do against me, you know. Uh -huh. But they found them. But I already heard about them. Her and her buddy Alicia. Yeah. But where did they come from? I mean, how did, I mean, I'm you saying, said you had the like, show one. They like came out of nowhere. Wait, 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 where was y'all at? We was kicking it. Yeah, like, how did y'all talk about it? How did y'all talk about it to make y'all want to come out there and go get him? Did you hear this? Look, okay, did you hear what he done? Yeah, we, we knew about it, but you know, we had to make an appearance. We yeah. females. So uh -huh. okay. We had to come in there looking all cute and everything. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. We didn't really mean to do you like that. We was a little more seasoned at that time. So we was a little more seasoned. At that time. Like yeah. you said, after that, you never lost a battle again. So right, I right, feel right, like right. we inspired you to do your hey, and be your best. Yeah. Y'all made sure that yeah. I make sure that it that I kill everything come through now. Right. Yeah. 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 No doubt. Yeah, I yeah. forgot all about that though. Too. Man, said, that's so crazy. Man, that's crazy. That. That yeah, yeah, we yeah. came through. Crazy. They had like a little cash prize. Remember you did yeah. Cash prize. And I was second. I got some money too. Right. Yeah. But it wasn't the cash I was looking for. Right. Yeah. I wanted the number one spot. You want the spot. Oh, you want to get that spot that night. Right. And it was but you didn't get it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but you didn't get it. You know what? Like, <laughs> Hold on. I got to oh. say this, though. What's Go up? ahead. 
we damn near all came out with the same amount though, because they was a group and I was a yeah, single. Oh, oh so you yeah. Yeah. So, so basically, oh, that's, 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 okay. that's okay. Yeah. That's okay. We all yeah. basically came right. out with the same amount. No doubt. Well, you know, I planned out. They was girls and he was a boy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> hey. <laughs> but they had they had somebody there from JD or somebody that was there was a record producer dude. Yeah, he did. I forgot who it was. Was it JD himself? Uh, no, Jay. No, it was, was somebody Jay. else. Though. Be right, right here. Right, if it was right, JD. Right, 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 right. But not somebody I think that was connected to him uh -huh. for real. Somebody big yeah. was there. And that okay, was the opportunity. Okay. Yeah. I think right. I had talked to him, but I was so young. Yeah, yeah and you we know was young too. And then you know, being females in that yeah. game, it was like back then everybody wanted something. Right, wanted something. Right, yeah, it was that's dirty. That's real. Real dirty. That's crazy. But you know what, too, and, and on top of everything, everybody don't know that you is some king to our host. So yes. all that, look at the, look yeah. how, look how yeah. all of the, all of the, yeah. the music ability, yeah. the whole, uh, the mindset. Yeah. You know, I know I deal with my co-host every day. I know. Oh, you know yeah. so he always striving to get there. <laughs> to the top. Uh -huh. You know, but that's real though. And it's like, you know, I see uh -huh. that. I see that. That's kind of infectious. Uh -huh. And you know, you know what? Even when my boys was little. It was like I had to kind of put my dreams on her, on, mm -hmm. on hold. Uh -huh. And I always say, you know, delay don't mean denied. Right. So we get greater talk later. Cuss, yeah. talk you know, cuss. so I just sat talk back that. and I, I was a mom. Right. You right, know, I right. am a mom. Yes. yes. But now that they're older, it's like yes. I'm starting. I can I'm, go I'm moving back. Now. I can go yeah. back. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and it's like yeah. everything that I had on hold, it was still in yeah. there. So during all this time, I'm still writing. Mm -hmm. Right. I'm yeah. writing. And it's it crossed started. over into yeah. like novels and Ooh. just the whole creative yeah. side. And that yeah. is like a go right now. Well, and like well, I'm running. There you go. <laughs> right. There you go. Finish right. what you started. Yeah. No that doubt. is so yeah. crazy. Yeah. Yeah. You know what? Okay, now I'm just sitting back right now and I'm just trying to think of something that's just kind of running through my head. Mm -hmm. And it's like, I, I know you so, you're so cold. If you oh. had to look at Turk and you wanted to just spill something. What would you, I mean, what type of rap would you just, I mean, you know, just looking at him and you know what I'm saying, and just something come off your head. You know what I'm saying? 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 I want to see something. What I want you just to do. Because I know, cause I know you just yeah. can go off of just, you know, somebody like, told penny. Dog, I know it's a penny. Okay. Right, right. Yeah. Well, that penny mean more than a penny. You know what I'm saying? Right. I want you to just, you know, just. Which All right, I'll, I'll be like, it, it's Turk. Okay. My little homie okay. from the hood. You know, we done grew up now and everything is all good. We gonna get this money and we gonna get this paper. We gonna drink this Patron. We gonna do it straight with no chaser. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know how I do and you know how I get it done. I'm gonna be number one, uh, not number two. Okay. Cause when you're number two, you gotta rise to the top. You know, you gotta get it together. Don't ever let the ball drop. And if it do, it's like another day. It's like New Year's Eve. I'm coming through. You better have something to believe to in. Ooh. Get it done. You understand? I got two sons, and I'm going to try to guide them and correct them and get them going. <laughs> and then I'm going to do what I do because everything is going to be showing and glowing. That's okay. Because I'm coming up off the dome. Ooh. Facts. Yeah, yeah. you know what I mean? Oh, honey. Give it to him. Give it to him. Give it to him. You know what? Now listen to that, man. That just, that's just right here. Me just ask her to do something, and then she just look at this man. And she just go. 100. Everybody can't do that. That's a talent. Oh God, that's, that's a, a talent. Gift. So you that's gotta wake gift. up, Lima. Yeah. That's what you got, man. And y'all know what's funny, gift. like my, my son, you know, they young. Mm -hmm. So I get to spitting around them and they were. Mm -hmm. like, and then they friends, right, you know, right, they, right, I get right. to mess with yeah. them and they yeah. like. Yeah. Why are you having this bit? Come on, come on. No, it's real. Right. That's what's it's up. real. That's what's up. Yeah. That's what's up. And when I, like I said the other day, when I saw, saw your son, I got a chance to meet you. Mm -hmm. Like, wow. Yeah. You know, like I said. But when I, every time I see him, it seems like he's a different person because uh -huh. they keep growing. Yeah. But when he sit back in the corner, and it's just like, I, I just wanted to tell him, man, you know, sometimes we know we hear stuff and we know we a lot of things going on in their mind out there mm -hmm. in the world. And it's like, but you just don't know, man. Your mom. You know what I'm saying? She kind of like a pioneer about that. Yeah, so yeah, if you yeah. if you want to try to find out about it, you just telling me about it, he wanted to get into the rap yeah, industry and things exactly. like that. So I'm like, you know what I'm saying? What better person to rub yeah. it to? But a lot of times we won't, we, we we was talking about that earlier. Remember mm -hmm. how we be looking for everything out there? Yeah. It's all way out there. Oh, really like yeah. You yeah. don't even know that. It'd be right, right up under there. your nose. Right yeah. 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 Tap it to your mom and she kind of can guide you. And right. You know what I'm saying? She's going to take he, away from you. He writing and he rapping and he rhyming now. Mm -hmm. You know, and I'm like, you got to sound like yourself. Mm -hmm. 
Like you gotta come up with your yeah. own. Yeah, be thing, different. Right. That's how you gonna stand out. They fifteen and sixteen yeah. now. Yeah, so, yeah, you know, yeah. They get cussed yeah. And everything. Yeah, yeah. Like, they the yeah. way. Right, but yeah. I'm like, but you gotta have like a commercial hit, yeah. like that one. Mm-hmm. You gotta yeah, be able to yeah. play yeah. it. You, gotta 100. Play. you know what I mean? Because yeah. that's how you gonna stand out. So I challenged him. So he came back last night and he kicked something to me. He was like, now I cussed a little bit. Yeah, you know what I mean. But it was just so like he grew overnight. Yeah, yeah. Like his rhyming skills just grew overnight. Yeah. And you know, and sometimes yeah. it be about yeah. just like listening to mom, you know what I'm saying, and listening to some things you said. Sometimes I, I'd be like, if I were you, I was you, because sometimes I just get on the piano and just play. Yeah. I don't play mm-hmm. for my kids. Yeah. And, and like Turk, he got these these kids, man, they're amazing. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And they, uh, man, they, they, they so talented, and it's like yeah. they just, they just spill off of him. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Uh-huh. He round there, you know what I'm saying? Maybe he was pop locking yeah. back in the day. Uh-huh. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh, God. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. you know what I'm saying? And we got, we got a couple shows that's coming still up. still do it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. right. Me too. Yeah, 100. Hey, it ain't never left nowhere. Yeah, listen, look, you know, the big machines, the big music machines, they come with the mic. Look, I still got one sitting up in my house. Like, I don't care. My kids be wondering if I'm rapping and I'm writing. It's in our DNA. It's in our DNA. still. Now yeah. and they come yeah. in, they grab the mic, and we just get to go. Yeah. We got like a whole cipher, and yeah. we just crack up laughing, yeah. like yeah, it's just envy. That's great. Yeah. Yeah. You should record that. Yeah, my son recorded. I'm like, yeah, let's keep it going. Yeah, no doubt. I told you that's why I was telling you. got the studio back there. We ain't went nowhere with the studio. The studio still back there. Yeah, we're still going. Yeah, and I'm ready. Remember, I told you like, yeah, he came up. He was ready, but you had all that day. Wow, wow, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, wow. he had closed up that day to clean up. But you right. know what? With all our guests, it's special. Mm-hmm. But every now and then, it's um, just a little tad special. Yeah. Er, if that's, <laughs> er, if that's right. right but you are, work. yeah, you, you are special and Thank you are you. extra that's special. Big so big with that awesome. being said, that's guess good. what? For that's everybody, we always pop a bottle of champagne. Pop that pop, bottle pop, over pop, there. Pop, 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 pop that top. So that's something that we always do, you know, on doing Appreciate every show. Appreciate it. Okay. Yes, indeed. And, and so, so we just gonna move along, and it's just like just so much other things I want to tap in with you on. Oh, so okay, good. now, so you moving along, you doing mm-hmm. what you doing? I mean, yeah. you got Lima at a buzz, you booming all the hey. way around. Yeah. So and I mean, I mean, are you on? Cause I'm hearing us hey, everybody. Well, thank so, you. So what? What if? if it's a lot of people that's looking at you, mm-hmm. a lot of young ladies. Yes. You already uh, deal with different, you say, at youth risk yeah. and all that stuff like that. Mm-hmm. So this just like motivating mm-hmm. stuff, yeah. you know what I'm saying? But they really look up. You just never know how much a person look up to yeah. you. Absolutely. And so when people are looking up to you like that, what do you, I mean, what, what do you got to tell them that so they can to make it easier for them if they want to try to do what you're doing? And because a lot of people don't even know nothing about the leadership program, which right. we're gonna get into later. Uh-huh. You know, because more people need to know about that. How like you yeah, went in there and just ace that through. Uh-huh. You know what I'm saying? But I mean, what would you tell you know, anybody else that just want to be like Courtney? Uh, like to, don't I tell them don't try to be like me. Mm-hmm. Be better. You okay. know, be better. Right. Yeah, right. Be, be okay. you. Yeah, that's really you you right. know, be you. You the best to ever do it. Yeah. Uh-huh. Be you. Uh-huh. And and I tell like young listen girls, to that, y'all. To young that. guys, like even people our age mm-hmm. and above. You know, I got a client that came to me is like sixty something. One of uh-huh. part of my life coaching program. Yeah. But you know, I tell people don't have limiting beliefs. Right. Like who said you can't do this? All right. mm-hmm. Who said let you them, can't do never that? Let right. You know what right. I mean? Don't right. never. Right. Right. Don't, right. Sometimes you know you have dreams that's bigger yeah. than what people yeah. think, and you yeah. and you have to watch who you share your dreams. And with. real, man. Yeah. I yeah. like yeah. that because you yeah. know what you know because yeah. you got some people that put their fears on you. Yeah. Just because they feel they feel like it couldn't work for them, yeah. don't that don't mean it can't work for you. You know what I'm saying? That's just real. You know what I mean? So never let nobody discourage you. What you believe in. That Anything like, is possible. You can think you. and you can do it. You yeah, know what I'm saying? That, you know, that's what I, I want people yeah. to get that message out and know, know that. And I've been mm-hmm. working like with the mental health boards here. Mm-hmm. Like, mm-hmm. like I want people, especially our people, because uh-huh. mental health is a stigma in the yes. black community. Yeah. Yeah. Like mm-hmm. I want people to know that sometimes it's okay not to be okay. Right. Like right. a lot of them right. traumas, you know, that shit is embedded right. in our in our bloodline. Yes. You know, Big our facts. parents carry trauma and their Big parents carry trauma. So a lot of us, we weren't raised on love. You know, we was raised on survival. Mm-hmm. So we got to sure. try to channel that and, and yes. tap into there our mental go. health and address it. And there you go. That's real conversation right now. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. 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 Y
that. You got to address that. Yeah, because, you know, we always thought, we always thought, when we seen that movie like it back in the day, we always thought we see somebody like that. Yeah, But no, you know what I'm saying? We had a lot of brothers go off, then they got snatched off the street. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Just regular 18 years old, put in the draft. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Put into the army and things like that. Put in war and they come back and you know what I'm saying? And then they don't stay. If they come back. If they come back. Right. If they come back. Right. You know, all of that going on. Or like, you know, even kids, like they hungry. They going to school. They can't think of nothing but they belly grab. Yeah, talk. Right. How you going to learn? When you hungry. Right. When you hungry. You know what When you hungry. How you going to learn? For real. So it's even simple stuff like that. Yeah, simple shit like that. Yeah, for real. Like a lot of people, you know, like when you go into like rich neighborhoods and them kids ain't had to deal with that. Yeah. And a lot of that. teachers ain't had Next. to deal with that. Nope. They so they're dealing with kids like they they it's not the fact that they can't learn, but they hungry. They yeah. hungry. Yeah. 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 Right. Yeah. You know they what I mean? Some ain't hate before they went to school. Yeah. And they can't tell you that. You know what I mean? We got to address that. Yeah. Yeah. As as a as a community. Yeah. You know, and come together on that side as a community. So for real. That's one hundred. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That means a lot right there. Battery. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Mental health is That's crazy. Important. Mental health. Mental health. And you know what? Like I said, we always try to act like it's so much more than what it is, but it goes on, man. And like I said, it's real out there. Yeah. The more we got more we feel like it. We got to pay more attention to it. We got to try to help where we can. Yeah. It's, it's been everybody's family. Everybody, yeah, got really one. Is. everybody got one. But you know what? With that being said, we gonna take another quick break, and you know what? SM Car Podcast is yeah. gonna be right back at y'all right. in a minute. Bitch, I came from nothing. 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 I turn nothing to something. 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 Bitch, I got it out the mud. Got it out the mud. Bitch, I got it out the mud. Got it out the mud. Running hard with no plug. Got it out the mud. All the niggas wanna do is just run it up. All the niggas wanna do is straight run it up. What I do, huh? Straight run it up. Right out hard, have to think, nigga, enough is enough. I'm calling niggas bluff, niggas don't really want nothing. Ooh, that's coming right out of the studio back there in the back, y'all. Back at you again, SMK Podcast. Right back there, done. J double zero. That's the new studio back there going on back there. So anytime you want to check in, check in back there with my brother, man, so they can get it going. Yeah. That's that new hit coming up out of that SMK recording label right there. But once again, we right back here with Miss Courtney. Hey. Huh? Oh, right. yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's because I'm really right like... now because we all feel like, you know, we all been knowing each other forever. Right. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So it's Cuzzo, it's Courtney, it's whatever. Right. <laughs> Whatever's going to be, huh? J Dub right. had a question he had wanted to ask you, and I was going to try to come turn it to him. He said he, was, he had something that he wanted to ask you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. First off, hey, I'm J Dub, you know. Uh-huh. 7 p.m. records, Pit Made Generation. We in the back back there, you know, with all the guys. Mm-hmm. SMK. It's a big collab in here. Sure. Yes, you feel me? But I did want to ask you, man, you know, wow. how did it come from rapping to poetry? You get what I'm saying? Yeah, no doubt. Mm-hmm. Just the evolution of Courtney over time growth. And back when I was doing music, I was spoiled. Look, I had my cousin Kyle Martin. Yeah. TK. TK. Like, he was like the greatest. He did like Nomads, Shot Swell. Uh You know, he was like one of the greats back in the day. Mm -hmm. And this was my cousin. So I go in there, I say something, and he would make the music to whatever I say. And I didn't have to pay for it. So I was spoiled. But my cousin, he left and he moved to Atlanta. So I really ain't had no music no more. And. Like me going into That's studios real, okay. and, you know, mm-hmm. trying to buy beats and everything. Right. It was hard for me because I was so used to having everything catered yeah, around, yeah, okay. you okay. know, okay. what I say, what I heard. Because yeah. I can hear music, right. too. So I hear yeah. it like, Boom. You know what? So, so let me ask you this. Right. Okay. With all that said, if you had an opportunity today to be in the studio and record and would you record rap? Would you get back into that lane? What time? Do you think that? What time we go? <laughs> no, let's, let's go. go. Let's go. Say that. Fire. Fire. Yeah. Fire. Fire. Yeah. Fire. Yeah. Fire. Yeah. Fire. Yeah. You know where we're headed, cuz. For real. You know where we're headed. Cuz I got a lot to say. And now, like, with my, by me doing the spoken word, like, everything, the, the words, like, I could take some of the spoken word stuff that I've done and put it to music. Yeah. Because sometimes that's it's hard for me. That's where it needs to be at. When I'm doing my spoken yeah. word, like, I get in the cadence. Uh-huh. Right. And, like, they don't really know I'm rhyming. 
Right. And I think that's how my spoken word is different from a lot yeah, of that's the right. Like, that's right. The, the, well, the, the different cadences because I'm really I'm rapping like for without okay, speaking. Okay. Right. For sure. You know what I mean? Okay. Well, so honey, well, that's honey, what well, sets honey. me apart from other spoken word artists because mine yeah. is like boom, boom, boom. You know how we count bars. You on your own. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. right. So yeah. if I'm doing my spoken word, yeah. like we count bars. You know, yeah. kids really they don't really know nothing about. about that's what, that's what makes poetry yeah. good. Yeah. You know, in slam words or whatever they call it. Right. Yeah. Because the way that they able to have it on cadence mm -hmm. in their brain, but they yeah. can make you see the same cadence without yeah. having the beat out there. Right. You know what I'm saying? You yeah. can bring somebody on your same level exactly. without even having the beat. Yeah. That's powerful enough within itself. Yeah, so and like know, now when you do something like, like that. I've been kinda of, remember Big Rude off organized noise. Big Rude, yeah, yeah, right yeah, on yeah, to the real yeah. and depth to the fame. Yeah. Uh -huh. So right now I've been studying a lot of his style and bringing it to like my spoken. That's word. so crazy. Yeah. That's <laughs> wow. yeah, and we right. spoke on him though like, like What's up with him? Like, right. I ain't heard like, nothing. Yeah, yeah, right. for real. Very good at me. I'm going to say right on to the real one. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Right. yeah. That's crazy. You know what, though? Mm -hmm. So, thinking about that, and then, like I said, we still we still moving on. Uh -huh. And we're talking about like so many things that you done done and everything, and it's all just so much. But, okay, now another thing that I've seen that you done done, and I know it is some things, sometimes you have to bend somewhere to, be, to go somewhere. Mm -hmm. And then, so when you, all of this stirred up in you, now you gotta try to get it up out you. Okay, so where did all that come from? I see right now you got a little gospel link in there. Yeah. Now, I, that's where I come from. Right. Like, they, I be singing, and they be like, man, go on, sing, get on G, go on, sing. But they don't know that. They, they know it all come from gospel, you know what I'm saying? That's why, you know. So yeah. tell them about that side. I mean, you know what I'm saying? What part of that that makes that, that Courtney, you, you know, know what I'm saying, from, go? From growing up mm -hmm. in, in the church, mm -hmm. and, and that, like, never left me. Okay. And it's just giving reverence and thanks to God. Like, I don't mm -hmm. care what I do. Yeah. I always got to go back yeah. to that. Yeah, for right, sure. right, 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 like, right. You right. Know, make things yeah. possible. Yeah, right. Sure. For sure. And like, right. even, okay, I'm going to give y'all an example. Like, the old 8 ball and MJG. Uh, mm -hmm. Like, oh, like oh, slave I, I, I got goosebumps you know, already. Back. I got goosebumps right. right. already. Yeah. Yeah. You're right. 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 And like, like 8 ball and MJG. All right, we got you. That's a, it's so stirring. Yeah, and uh -huh. that right there, yeah. man, that'll get to that. That'll boost you across all kinds of demographics. You better say that because, wow. like, great. if you look at people like what's his name, Canton, Canton Jones. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, I don't know yeah. if y'all hear to him. I, I know yeah. that's my guy. Like, I heard go. Yeah. Yeah. gospel, yeah. right? Yeah, gospel, yeah. gospel yeah. dude. I'm, so, you feel is you feel a Rod Wave? Man. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Ooh, you better Rod Wave. That's what that 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 you know. like Ruben Stutter, you know, right. you yeah. gotta like Rod Wave. Hey, you, you know what? What's crazy? I just asked my Rob, son. Yeah. I'm like, man, what do y'all be going through? Like, why everything's so sad? Uh, Sometimes with, like, and, 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 you know what? He do be on that though. But I be feeling it. But after so after you you hear so much of it, you be like, oh, you need to change it up. Rod Wave is like they rain every day. Call it, but damn, change it up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that <laughs> yeah, yeah, that, that, that's yeah. Yeah, I understand it. But you know, so that's probably you know what they grew up in. They yeah, but yeah, and you don't know where yeah, he came from. Know, how he, so, you know, how yeah. he was brought up. You know what I'm saying? You know, yeah, we outside true. looking it in. Is. You can't yeah, judge the book sure, by its sure. cover. So yeah. Yeah. he made and, it. And that's what, you he know, made it. That's for damn sure. He made it. I write on what I feel. Take that from me. Yeah, I write on what I feel. So I know the next person writing on what they feel. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah honey, man. You know what I'm saying? I, I love him though. I love him. Yeah. Though, me too. Me too. Me too. You yeah. know, you can tell he uh, he got pain in his heart. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? for real. And that's yeah. just so it's, it's like it's therapy. Like yeah, it's it therapy out. for sure. And I applaud the young brother for getting for it sure. out. For sure. Oh God, cause he do. And I I've seen uh, uh um he did something with uh Kevin Gates uh, on, on on a stage. You know what I'm saying? They had to like getting groomed and shit. You know what I'm saying? Right. Cause he was like going through something like. I guess he was, I guess he was shy, and then at the same time, you know, he was not for sure. yeah, you know, it did you not, know. you know, you know what I mean. But they brought it out of him, you yeah. know. Mm -hmm. And at the end of the uh, the performance, you know, what I'm saying Kevin Gates hugged him. Yeah, you right. know what I'm saying. Right. You know what I mean. Yeah, so I can tell, like, yeah, much, you know he didn't been through something. You know what I'm saying. Yeah, and I can, I, can, I hey, you know, I, I, my, my hands go out to him. Bro. Right, you and know, you know, I think that's thing. our responsibility. So, yeah, I don't, want, I don't. Should I say like I'm an OG? Like, yeah, I'm right, not right, an OG right. like Dean is like the OG. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna say like I'm a junior OG. Yeah, like when I see 
like younger kids, like I just want to groom them. For like, sure. I, I, like, I a lot of them need. Right. For real. Yeah. And, and, yeah. Like, yeah. A lot of them need that. Artists, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And they looking forward for that. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah. For real. A lot of them ain't got no guidance. So, yeah. you know, we got to be the ones that, you know what I'm saying? They looking forward for us to do that. You yeah. know what I mean? And so, like I tell my brother, I always got my you know, ear to the street. Yeah. 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 But I like that. You know what I'm saying? And this is just that, you know, you just have to just keep on moving and keep on moving. There's so much things, like I said, about you, and there's so much things about her. Even we, we we was talking like in the last uh, segment that we had, we was talking about um, how different things. Okay, everybody done got to a certain point. Mm -hmm. A lot of people don't know the little struggles that they done been right. through. Certain things you have to go through to get through that. So we was talking about that. But people start to realize that you know some things was a little harder than it was for the next person to get there. So okay, mm -hmm. we look at that yeah. and say like right now you had to go through school. Yeah. Okay, a lot of people don't know you took school. Mm -hmm. That's what we were talking about in the last segment that we got a producer and an R&B rapper. A lot of people don't know that he went to school right. for that and they'll put in work for that. So yeah. after there, after a while, things started to pay off. You had, but you put in your work yeah. for it. I did. Okay, so people don't tell them about Cincinnati University. And that's yeah, my sister right. university, so yeah. that's a cold university. university. So you've been out to Cincinnati yeah. University? Uh -huh. Yeah, right. so right. you don't put in work. So, so it's just not like just Courtney yeah. just pop yeah. up on the scene. Yeah. I, you you got you got to give yourself more credit yeah. than you do, and then it's yeah. like you know I I done so to get here. Right. Yeah. 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 You, know yeah. you got to bring it out. Yeah. Hey, do you have an aunt, uncle, mom, dad, maybe even a neighbor at the point of retirement where they ready to get their retirement and they need help getting it, and also they may need help with their Medicare. Well, they not that computer savvy, or they need help navigating through the system, or maybe just even simple counseling. With over 15 years of experience, we have a new company that's here right now in the social security system that can help you get what you deserve. It's called Emerge LLC. And that contact number is Emerge LLC 2021 at gmail.com. Emerge LLC 2021 at gmail.com. And just ask for Caroline. It's easy to apply and you can get what you deserve. Emerge. Help you with the counseling and the navigating to get you what you deserve. Emerge.